All right, let's get this test print rolling. First, we're gonna start with the standard purge procedure. We have to clean out all the old black ABS that was inside the extruder. Because we used black ABS and we're switching to a white material, it takes a lot of purge material to sufficiently clean out the extruder because any little tiny black pellet can contaminate a lot of white. Then I had to prime the nozzle for the white and I ended up blowing a burst disc. That happens when the extruder reaches over 5,000 PSI and sometimes when you use purge material in a new material and you let it sit for a little bit, it can kind of bind up and cause the pressure to build up in there. This is actually the first time I've ever blown one. That cost me about 75 bucks. All right, so now we got the burst disc replace, repriming the nozzle with the new material. It's looking good, not contaminated. So now we can get the test print started. So right here, we're printing a partition screen. And right off the bat, you can see that we need to bring the poly lines together a little bit more. But overall, we wanted to test to see if the material warps, what kind of adhesion we're getting between the layers, and optimize our settings for a final print. So that's a standard test print procedure. Thanks for watching.